today we are making a seed germination packet. Now, what that means is we're going to take some seeds and we have some barley seeds here, happen to have them in the classroom, but you can use any seeds. If you have grass seeds laying around, if you have beans, which beans are a type of seed, uh, you could use lima beans from the, the, the freezer uh, or dried beans. You can't use canned beans, so don't use those. So we're going to take those beans and we're going to make them germinate. We're actually going to have them turn into sprouts or small plants. So the first things that we're going to need is we're going to need a plastic sandwich bag. You could use a bigger bag, but sandwich bag will do just fine. We'll need some paper towels. Now, if you're going to use the select a size type, uh, the ones that are a little bit small, you want to use two just to make sure that you're you have enough paper towel to hold enough water to help your plants, your seeds germinate. If you have, if you don't have the select the size ones, which is fine, just use one full size paper towel and you're gonna start by folding it in half. From there, you're going to fold it in half again and again and again, just, just so that you can get it wet. And then we're going to wring out the excess water because we don't want it dripping. So I have here a small container of our seeds. Now from our fold, I'm going to place these seeds and spread them out on our paper towel so that they aren't on top of each other and we'll be able to see them really good and put them on one side of the fold. All right, so the water is what's really going to help the seeds germinate. It turns out you don't actually need sunlight. So what it, when you think about it, if you put seeds in the ground, they're not getting sunlight. So the seeds just need moisture to help them germinate. They soak up some water and, create, and cause a, something inside the seed to decide, okay, I have enough water, so I am now going to turn into a new plant. So I'm gonna take my paper towel and I'm gonna fold it back over. I'm gonna press it down lightly so that the seed is fully touching all the paper towel. And then I'm gonna place my paper towel inside my sandwich bag. Doesn't have to be anything crazy. Just simply stuff it in there. Try to get it as flat as possible because it does make it easier to view. All right, so I'm gonna just flatten it out. Now, when I look at it, I can see my seeds through my bag and in my paper towel. So I'm gonna take out some of the air. The air isn't that isn't important either, but it just makes it easier to put it in, put it someplace flat. So now I have my bag with my wet paper towel and my seeds, and I'm going to, and it's closed, so water won't leak out, moisture won't get out. And then I can place this pretty much anywhere. I wouldn't put it in a dark place like under the sink or anything because you might forget, but you could definitely leave it on a countertop. You could put it on the windowsill, but that, you know, it's iffy because of the cold weather. Uh, you just leave it in your bedroom, on your desk, on your bureau. Really doesn't matter anywhere. What does matter is that the bag stays closed and the moisture is not going to escape. So the seeds are going to be able to soak up a lot of that moisture to help them germinate. So. In about two to three days, we should start to see something happen. We're gonna to start to see the seeds actually begin to turn into little tiny sprouts or small plants. So that is how you make a seed germination packet and we'll be using this in our next portion starting on next week.